This is Keith Landecker, and I'm here to give you some valuable information. We are with our good friends over at TVFCU, and I'm with the sales manager, Brian Fryer, and he's going to take us through the process of owning a home, getting a home, getting your loans, and so much valuable information. Man, you're going to get a lot from this. Tell us about the process of getting a home and getting your loans, and I know that's a scary thing for a lot of people, but tell us exactly how that process works. Yeah, it's, it pretty has, much has changed over the years. It's got a little, little bit more detail, a little, a little more complicated, but uh, uh, you especially you want to work with the lender. Uh, and of course, being with TVFCU, I want to recommend TVFCU since we are a credit union. We're locally owned, operated here in the Chattanooga area, and uh, with, with a credit union, uh, credit unions uh, have a lot more leeway. We can do a lot more than some of our competitors can so uh, you'll definitely want to, to look for a lender whether you're buying a home you're refinancing you will want to talk to a lender that knows the area and knows the, the community too so uh, TVFCU being a credit union being locally owned and operated and owned by our membership uh, we hope you come to TVFCU because uh, we have a lot of programs that are that are geared uh, for our membership and for our area Brian do me a favor talk to our listeners about financing I know that's real important yeah you you want to um, and I always say this uh, uh, the first step always the first step you'll want to sit down and you want to do a budget. You want to look and see if, if you're buying, you want to see what, what you can afford. Uh, uh, want to look at the budget, what you currently owe, your outgo, uh, your monthly payments, your, you know, whether it be utilities or it be car payments, credit cards, you want to look at that. And, and if you're paying rent, you want to see what you can afford right now as pertains to purchasing a home. Uh, if you're refinancing, you may want to pay off some debt. Uh, we have a lot of people nowadays with mortgage rates being so low, historically low, in my 23 years, this is the lowest I've ever seen them. Uh, um, you want to look at maybe if you're looking at maybe refinancing, bringing that outgo down and maybe paying off some debt. Uh, uh, if you have a kid going to college, uh, if you're paying for private school, uh, if you're wanting to put in a pool or something like that or do some home improvement. A lot of people are staying in their homes right now since the inventory is so low and it's kind of difficult to find homes right now. A lot of people are refinancing and just improving the home they're living in. So uh, you want to do that. You want to, The budget is the first thing you want to talk about or look at. Next thing you want to look at uh, your credit too. Uh, um, a lot of people may not be ready to refinance or purchase right now because they may have some, some issues on their credit. I do recommend going to a website that the government has set up. It's called annualcreditreport.com. Uh, you can go there and pull all three of your credit bureaus, uh, Equifax, TransUnion, and Experian. Um, every year you can pull one of those per year by federal law with no cost to the borrower. Uh, go to those and look and see if there's any blemishes on your credit. If you have any charge-offs, any medical collections, uh, anything that you've had in the past that, that was what we call a ding on your credit, mm -hmm. see if you can get those taken care of. Uh, clean that credit up before you go to a lender because the lender is going to pull all three of your credit bureaus in the, here in the mortgage world and uh, we're going to see if there's anything that's impacting your credit and also those items may be in, impacting your credit scores too. Mm -hmm. and if it impacts your credit score that can impact uh, the type of loan that you can get and your interest rate too. So if you have any things in the past, see if you can get those cleaned up before you go to your lender. Just do be aware getting those cleaned up can take some time. Uh, sometimes it can take several months, uh, sometimes up to six to 12 months to get those cleaned up, paid off, etc. So make sure you do that first before uh, you come to a lender. Uh, very, very important, especially if you're looking to get the lowest rate you can on a refinance or a purchase. All right, Brian, tell us how we can get a hold of you because these are, these are great information that uh, I'm sure our listeners will would love so how do they talk to you personally sure great yeah i have i have a mortgage uh, team of 11 mortgage originators we can be reached at 423-634-3600 or through our website at tvfcu.com